First Alert Weather with Madeline Parker is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. We're seeing a little bit of rain on First Alert Doppler Network this afternoon. We're seeing some scattered showers, especially across southern Illinois and into southeastern Missouri. Very light showers might see an isolated storm. We see a little bit more activity heading into northwestern Kentucky and northwestern Tennessee but we should be seeing some pretty drier conditions later on this evening. Here's what we can expect around 5 o'clock again. We see those scattered showers, potentially an isolated storm or two. We do see those winds picking up. Remember, when we see these arrows, it means it's at least 15 mile per hour winds. Those are going right across 57. So if you're driving tonight, be aware of that. Two hands on the wheel if you can. Now around 1030, we're going to be seeing a lot more clearing up. We see a few clouds coming in to northwestern Kentucky, but clearing mostly overnight. You see a potential chance for some showers over in northwestern Kentucky in the early morning hours, but around 8 o'clock looking like much sunnier conditions to wake up to for your Thursday. But we'll see a few clouds rolling in and out throughout the afternoon with pretty dry conditions. We do see a lot of moisture over to the east, but that's going to be staying out of our way for the most part. Still seeing a little bit of a breeze picking up in southern southeastern Missouri along 55 and then around 10 o'clock looking like much clearer conditions with just a few clouds. Friday morning waking up to partly cloudy skies in southern Illinois, northwestern Kentucky and southeastern Missouri seeing lots of sunshine for your Friday morning. Friday afternoon does have some potential for some scattered showers to once again pop up, but these are very small scattered showers. Right now about 86 degrees outside, 13 miles per hour, 55% humidity. Feels a little bit warmer outside, almost feels like 90, but we are still seeing those mid 80s tonight. Looking at 60, 61 in Fredericktown, 66 over in Kennett. 62 in Perryville, 63 over in Carbondale, partly cloudy skies in Mount Vernon at 61 and 65 over in Murray. Now tomorrow, temperatures going to be a little bit warmer, getting up to the mid to high 80s, about 84 in Fredericktown, 87 over in Kennett, about 85 here in Cape Girardeau and over in Carbondale with partly cloudy skies. Paducah about 83, 79 over in Murray. Now here's what we can expect over the next couple days, about 90 degrees on Friday, but it does look like we'll be seeing some lows in the 60s. Now let's go ahead and look at the weekend. We do see about 93 on Saturday, 92 on Sunday. We have a 60% chance of thunderstorms, and here's what we can expect with those storms rolling in, looking at that severe threat level, and here's how it's going to be moving throughout the afternoon, about 1.30. We have a pretty low threat right here, and then into the afternoon and evening, it's going to get a little bit stronger getting into our eastern counties. Now let's go ahead and go back to our main seven day forecast and here's what we can expect for the rest of the week. Looking at about small chances of rain on Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, but we're still sticking with those pretty high temperatures in the high 80s and low 90s.